Listen, Moses had that same kind of theology that a lot of us have, right? If you're following Jesus, if you're loving God, then everything works out. Everything's good in your life. If you love Jesus, you can always find a parking place. <laughs> right? The IRS always owes you money. It's just good to follow Jesus. Right? And I told you several years ago when I was diagnosed with cancer, I, I, I told you one of, one of my problems was I thought Jesus had broken the deal. And the deal is I put up with all of you and nothing bad happens to me. That's the deal. <laughs> you think that too, don't you? You think if you're doing what Jesus wants you to do and you know you're following what he's leading you to do, that things ought to work. Things should not get worse, but they do. Why? Because we have an enemy. And when you start doing something good for Jesus, Jesus isn't the only one who notices. And the world will turn against you. Now, what do we do in that moment? One, we expect it. You're not surprised by it. Okay, why are we not surprised? Jesus said this is what would happen. You remember the Beatitudes, the Sermon on the Mount? Right? This chapter 5 in, in, in Matthew. Blessed are the poor in spirit. Blessed are those who hunger and thirst after righteousness. We love them. They're beautiful. You know the next paragraph? We always stop when we get down to the hard part. The next part? Blessed are you when men revile you and persecute you and say all manner of evil falsely against you for the sake of my name. Blessed are you because this is the way they treated the prophets before you. Blessed are you when the world turns against you. Paul, he told Timothy, suffer as a good soldier. It gets harder before it gets better. Peter and John, preaching the gospel. They're arrested several times. They're, they're abused several times. The last time they're beaten because the religious and political leaders didn't know what else to do with them. And they are released. And Peter and John leave celebrating that they were found worthy to suffer for the name. 